In this video, I want to share with you some things I've learned in editing sloped pipe that will speed up your production. Also, I want to show you a clipped view lisp routine that will help cut through some of the clutter in your complicated models. But first, let's look at editing sloped pipe. The pipe has to be parallel to the XY plane. If we look at the XY plane on edge now, we're perpendicular to the XY plane. You can see that the run of pipe is not parallel to it. So for those of you who are new to CAD works, if you move this assembly, it moves parallel to the XY plane. However, when you try to connect these two, the sloped line follows the slope and will not connect. So let me back out of this. Get back to the home view. So let's look at a setting up the user coordinate system for a pipe that's sloped in the Y direction. We right click and we use the three point. And what we're going to establish first is the X axis from endpoint to endpoint. That sets the x-axis parallel to the slope of the line. And then we'll set the y-axis perpendicular to that. So now that when we look at the top view, we're in the x-y plane and we can edit this. If we look at the edge of the XY plane, and this will be the front view, we can see now we're perpendicular to the XY plane. We can see now that our pipe is parallel to that plane. So we'll go back to the top. Now when we move this, of course, this pipe will drag in a straight line and it'll make that connection. Now, to keep from having to do this, every time we want to edit a pipe in the Y axis, we can go over here and right click, name, UCS, save, and we can give it a name. And let's say Y slope. And you can see it's over here. So let's go back to the world. Now, if we have to do any more editing in a line that's parallel to the y-axis or running in the y-direction, we've already got our coordinate system set up. We don't have to go back and reestablish it. Now, you can do the same for the x-axis and establish a coordinate system for the x-axis. Now. If you want to delete these, and I'm sorry, my uh, screen capture software will not show these flyouts, but it's under View Coordinates. Now, if you don't have Coordinates panel visible, go over here and right click, and a and this won't show in the in this video. There will be a pop-up window that comes up. You go to Show Panels. And then another pop-up window will come up, and about the one, two, three, four, fifth item down is coordinates. Check that, and then this will appear. So if you want to delete the views you made or they're not correct, you go to that tab, and here's your, here's your views. You just right-click on it and delete. 